A dramatic scene unfolded after an officer was shot at Pinellas Park gas station earlier this week while responding to a domestic incident. The Pinellas County Sheriff's Office released security footage from the gas station as well as police body camera video. As ABC Action News reporter Julie Salamone reports, the sheriff says that suspect made statements to authorities showing no remorse for his actions. Surveillance video from inside a Circle K in Pinellas Park shows a suspect pointing a gun at a man, yelling at him to hand over his keys. Give me your keys now. Give me your keys now. Which one is your car? Which one? Yeah. The Pinellas County Sheriff's Office says that suspect, 24-year-old Calvin Brockington, had just shot a Pinellas Park police officer and was trying to get away. From this guy who just shot a police officer, shot at another one, is, is that he says, with a shot left, I could have killed the man. And he knew that he had fired five times and he had six rounds. Officer Jacob Durr responded to a domestic incident Tuesday night at the gas station on Ulmerton Road. The pregnant victim pulled into the gas station after arguing with Brockington, a former boyfriend. She goes into the bathroom in the Circle K and she calls 911 and says that Brockington was in the car, he was in the parking lot. The sheriff says Brockington pops open the car door, instantly firing five shots. The officer was shot in the arm and takes cover. The sheriff says the suspect shot at another police officer who returned fire, but the suspect was not hit. Brockington takes off. He was fleeing uh, down 275, uh, driving absolutely recklessly with total disregard for anyone's safety. And again, the speeds were about 150 miles an hour at one point. Authorities used a pit maneuver to stop the stolen car in St. Pete. They arrested Brockington, who has a lengthy criminal history and now faces numerous charges. The officer is expected to make a full recovery. In Pinellas Park, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.